this trellis system is a little bit of an offshoot of a VSP or vertical shoot positioned trellis system. We have a bilateral cordon system. In other words, here's the trunk on my left. Here's the end of the cordon and then another cordon goes that way. And as you can see, for the most part, the canopy is grown in an upright or vertical shoot positioned uh, configuration. There is some modifications because there's some short cross arms in here to separate the wires and give a little bit more of, I call it the, the vase type uh, canopy. So therefore there's some shading on both sides. A lot of true VSP type of trellises is pretty much up and down and boxed across the top. And I think a lot of that is grown for aesthetics, not necessarily for practicality. To me, a, a nice modification of the trellis system and the canopy, much as we see here where we got a little bit over the tops, but a, not enough for these canes to come back down and to shade the fruit zone as another layer of leaves is very, very good. But again, with this bilaterally trained system and these cross arms that are in here on the stakes, it gives a little bit of spread to the fruit zone. We're actually in these blocks trying to grow our spurs outward instead of straight up and down. We're trying to come outwards on like 45 degree angles and get an open V in the cordons, but also we have the cross arms here to separate our foliage wires to separate the foliage as well and to kind of open up the center a little bit. Again, this is very good because you can see we've got, for example, two clusters of fruit hanging right here. And then across the canopy, across the cordon, we have two clusters of fruit hanging freely from these. They're independent. So again, we're trying to open up within the cordons our fruit zone and not have all the fruit stacked on top of each other. It uh, takes a little bit of time to train the spurs, to get the vines trained this way, but it sure is very conducive to growing excellent, excellent Cabernet grapes.